Good morning friends and I am back with another video and on Sunday Pixie and Roxy came home but unfortunately our video for that didn't go up yesterday which was Monday because of the events of what was happening on the Sunday. Now when we brought Pixie and Roxy home everything just kind of kicked off, it was so busy um, me and Jamie spent about good four or five hours in the living room working on a few things and today I would like to share what it is that we have been working on and what we have broken our backs for to do um, on the Sunday which is the reason why the video went up late. So let me show you guys. I cannot believe I actually have it back and my back is broken from doing what we've done but in a way I'm disappointed for what we've got rid of but in a way I'm kind of more happy of the fact that it's not there and that we don't have to worry about it anymore and it's less things for us to worry about so let me show you what we have done. Are you ready on the count of three Pixie? Are you ready? One, two, you ready Roxy? Three! Yay! Okay you guys, so most of you will probably know from our videos, our previous videos and Instagram and all that kind of social media stuff that we had a marine fish tank just over here. Unfortunately, long story, I'm not going to get into it, um, but the fish got unwell. Um, a few had passed on in the space of a couple of weeks and the tank was becoming more and more maintenance. Um, and because the fish were sick, the proper way of doing it for marine is quarantining the fish, which means that you have to have an extra tank. That tank had to be so many litres for the fish that we had and we basically did not have the room to do that and it would have been a bigger expense. So basically within a space of a week, the fish, the rock, the sand, all the corals and everything had gone to other people. And myself and Jamie had just decided on the Sunday, once everything had gone out the tank, to help um, to dismantle the tank and move it out into the hall, which meant that we would have the dog's corner back. Now, basically, we still have the tank to sell, but it's out in the hall, so hopefully that goes quick because I don't have a great deal of space in the hall, but it meant that we didn't have an empty tank full of stuff sitting in here, and it meant that we could have the dog's corner back, which I am really excited about because it's just space in here. There's not a lot of it with the tank there. And there is a wee bit more space now. Um, but I'm super excited to get the dog's space back. So let me just show you what we have done. Now, the only problem I have is these indents here. So we're going to need to keep the hoover going on these. That's obviously where the tank had sat. So over here we have the mountain of toys that Pixie and Roxy have. I really need to get a bigger bucket, but it doesn't look so much now that there's so much space here, but it is a lot of toys and we're getting our pet nature box through the door and we're also doing a box swap with um, Milo from Instagram. So I'm pretty sure this will be a wee bit fuller by the end of the month. And it's also Pixie's birthday as well at the end of the month. So a bigger bucket might be required for here. We also have um, the dog bed. Now, I'm determined I might get a bigger one. I don't know. I found two of them the next morning sleeping in the same bed, which is not like them at all. Now, when they were at my mum and dad's, they were created, so they were closer together. And I don't know if, obviously, because of that, they think that they can lie in the same bed together, which is fine, I don't have a problem with that, but they're a bit squished for space in here. So I'll see how it goes. Um, Roxy sometimes just sleeps on the couch or sleeps on the floor. Um, she doesn't really go into a bed, but I was quite surprised to see that, you know, yesterday morning. So we've got the bed over here. 
and then we've got like nothing here um, and then we have the dog's bowls um, here now we've changed the bowls and I'll tell you the reason why because the old bowls that we had was the black holder with the metal tin and Roxy hadn't been eating her breakfast and we think it's because when she eats the tin rattles against the plastic and it makes a noise and she doesn't like noise at the best of times so um, we decided to change the bowl in fact this was Misty's bowl Misty's got two of these and um, she let us use one to try and it has worked so my mum says I could keep this one as she already has one um, and she's been doing really well in this bowl and of course it says doggy diva perfect explanation there for her and then we've obviously got like the dog's water bowl which hasn't changed and we went into pets at home last night to get the same bowl for pixie because we didn't want different bowls we think because they're not eating at the same time is because Pixie's still got the bowl that rattles and because they're next to each other she's not eating so we've had to change both bowls but unfortunately as you can see the bowls are different shades of pink. I couldn't get the same bowl as this one so they are a different shade of pink which is fine because they both have different expressions on them so Roxy's Doggy Diva and Pixie hers is a lighter bow and she has princess paws now these are actually cat and dog bowls so that's probably more in the cat section but it's the same bowl does the same thing it doesn't really matter and the reason for me moving these bowls here is merely because as you can see here and up here is where Roxy has done her damage before any of this was put into place and as you can see the carpet as well this is when she suffered from separation anxiety so I've put the bowls here hoping that she can't get into that area and that she chews nothing else are you in bed? Oh, you in bed you like your corner? Mm -hmm. I think the dogs were very excited to get their corner back. They're a bit wet because we've just came back from the park. I've not gave them breakfast yet because I've been waiting to show you the dog bowls while they're clean. And the dog's faces aren't in them. Okay, you guys, so that is the dog's corner. Super excited to get that back. And I have a lot of videos to do today and edit today. And I'm back at work on... Thursday for four days and then I'm off for four days. I basically have, I made a list last night because I thought there's no way I'm going to remember all these videos off the top of my head. So I have about 11 videos lined up to do and I think I can do at least four of them now. So I'm going to try and get them done today, edit them today and save them today so I can just kind of put them up, you know, kind of gradually, get most of it done. But Thank you guys for watching, I will leave you there. Now don't forget to hit a thumbs up if you like this video, leave us a comment and let us know what you think of the corner. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do and we will catch you on the next video. Bye guys!